so I'm with Ollie Riley from Hi4. Ollie, Hi4 is a, uh, a, a big supplier of work holding solutions, amongst yes. other stuff, isn't it? You've got Hi4.shop. Tell us a little bit about that. The, the shop's like a new e-commerce website that we've been working on over the last year. So it's a, a joint venture that we've been going along with our marketing department and it's kind of been going on for a while now when we're, we're getting to the point where we can start marketing it more and, and get it out there in the open. So there is more than what we're going to see today, but let's talk about this yeah. product specifically. This is work holding for CMM machines. It, 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 explain what it is and how it works. So individually on this, this is the matrix clamping system. So the blue clamps indicate that they're all CMM equipment. So you've got your T-slot table that you'd obviously mount your stuff on the T-slots. And then you've got your adjustable work supports. Obviously, you're not going to need machining forces, so it's just a little light clamp just to clamp on top of the component. It looks like a very modular style system. I mean, th so this yeah. would be secured to your table of your CMM machine, and then you build up your blocks, do you, depending on the height of yeah, where, wherever you want? It all depends on the component that you're holding. So if you've got a, a taller component, if you need more clearance, you can have a super bad riser blocks in there to make the system higher or lower. If you need to get on angles, you can have angle plates to angle the component around. Okay, well let's pick up this component here. This looks uh, distinctly like a medical um, part, I, I think. Uh, we've all, well, we haven't got one. We've got something that's shaped like that in our bodies. Can you yeah. tell us where, how it would work on there? Okay, no worries. So they're all individual springs. So if I loosen the pin field up, as you can see there, they all bounce back. So. As I pop the pins down and locate them around the component, I will then tighten the system up itself individually. And then your components clamp there. You just pop your work support on there as well. And like you say, you don't need to secure it too hard, do you? Because you're just coming, this is just purely for measurement. You come in, you'll, you'll pick your points, and then you've got you know, your, your true, true uh, dimensions of the component. Yeah. No, you will be. All you'll be doing is just touching down, so it doesn't require any specific holding force as that such. Nowhere near as much as obviously on a machine. And then the, these here, then similar principle, but just different styles of, um, yeah, just different styles of ways of yeah. holding the part. Well, they all work in the exact same way. So the principle behind them is all the same. They're still spring loaded, and they all work with a simple five mil Allen key. So if I just pull that down there, you can see that they have locked through the pin fields, and then you release the pin field for the component. I imagine it generally it's very quick to use, it's, it's, it's modular. What, what's yeah. the alternative to this? I mean, I've never been a, I mean, I've used a lot of machine tools in my time, but I've never really had much uh, use of a CMM yeah. machine. Well, the, the idea of this is to eradicate the need for fixturing. Because if you've got a certain component that's an awkward shape and size and you have to build up a fixture for it on a CMM or on a CNC machine, it's a lot more time consuming and it's also going to make it a lot more awkward and it's going to waste people's time really and it could be more cost effective. How do you buy it? As a kit format or do you just buy each individual block and part and yeah. then build it up over time? They come in kits, so they come as modular kits. So as we can see here, we've got the kits with the, the three individual modules there. The same with the other module there with the three modules. And then we've also got the unique one with the vice. Um, where it comes on its own rail as well with a pivot point as well. So for more efficient uh, inspection, this is the ideal solution. So for if, you, if you're looking to uh, yeah, improve the way you measure things, where do you yeah. visit to find this, Ollie? Come to hi4.shop or give me a call or pop through to the office and come and see us. Okay, brilliant. Thank you very much.